What's good, YouTube? There's been a huge issue with the foreign print cards uh, over in the Europe region versus USA cards. And this is more of a buyer beware. So this is Duel Saga, and this is from Alintheo. And he shows a fresh out-of-the-pack Bro Hunter against a common Jinzo. And look at that bending. And so one huge problem with the foreign print cards is they also bend different than ours. They bend short ways. So when they're in the deck, it's bending in an upwards U. Whereas our ends don't bend at all, but yet our cards bend this way. So my cards have been out a little bit, and they have a bend that goes, like, long ways. So it double bends against our cards and makes them findable in the decks if you're using their print versus ours. And it's not just, like, this Duelist Saga set. It's been happening. This is a seller on eBay. I'm not going to disclose who it is, but I took the picture. This is being listed as a near mint invocation look at how it bends upwards that is crazy if you would think that this would not be found in your deck that's insane now people mentioned that there's ways to unwarp cards and undo but these are so warped that i actually had uh at ycs atlanta like we we had made our uh zodiac barrages completely good before the tournament and throughout the tournament one of them became bad enough that the judges had to pull me back through it and say hey you got to replace this man like you i can find this in your deck every time and we had fixed it before the tournament that's just insane so uh, the warping on their foil is really different and i guess they're just using some kind of different material than ours it has to be right because it's bending in a in an upwards u within the deck and not just like long ways like ours does it it just has to be a different kind of foiling and that almost automatically makes it a marked card and throughout a tournament you're shuffling you're shuffling you're shuffling as it becomes warped again it becomes realistically unusable so again this is what's kind of hard about buying on tcg player or ebay and why maybe buying slash trading in person is a lot bigger but you can't do that at events with anybody but vendors so it's going to be really hard to make sure you access the right cards and get you know tcg print uh over here in america like the uh american print rather than the euro print so it's a big issue there's not a lot of answers you can unwarp your cards as much as you can try to but again be careful throughout the tournament and try to make sure you can't find your own cards in your deck uh there's been a lot of dqs going around and it's just unfortunate because it's a problem with their product that comes over here so it, it really sucks that this is happening